that outfoxed in teams, he really showed uh, how viable Ganon can be in teams. And that's a good thing when I say that. But right now we're going right into the match, and Rick's not stopping with these up airs. No jump? No jump. Oh, no, he gives him, him one. He gives him one. He's like, here, take this. <laughs> but. Oh. Ooh. It's almost even. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Welcome to Ganon. <laughs> nah. All right. So I think Rick Rick's going to play a baiting game because that's kind of what you do with Ganon. Ganon's one of those characters who gets a lot when you don't do the right thing. Yeah. So if you just do the right thing every time, there's not a lot he can do. You've talked about it before when we've commentated Mentaculous sets where you, uh, where Ganon is looking for you to make the read. He's going to like, he's going to cover this option, whereas like, that's the only option he can cover. Yeah. Whereas with Fox, I can, he can, he's so fast, he has great uh, frame, frame data. I'm going to cover this option and then still have time, time to cover this option and this option. Yes, uh, Ganon's just too slow to cover um, like a lot of tech options. <laughs> he's got too many muscles. Yeah, dude. It's too big. Too Been in the strong. gym too long. It, it's that, so uh, small. it's that, uh, Super Saiyan t two trunks <laughs> where he's just too strong and can sell. But yeah, so, um, like you said, with Fox, he's fast enough that he can cover a lot of options. Ganon doesn't have that luxury. But what he can cover, he covers really, really strongly. <laughs> yeah. And you will regret teching in place. Strongly's uh, kind of uh, maybe a, a little bit of a... Understatement. Understatement, thank you. Lost my words there because of Ganon. The base on Ganon's, Ganon's moves is echoing over our headphones. Yes. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Everyone knows when Ganon plays because you just kind of hear, feel like your chair shake a little bit. Yeah, he, it's like those interactive movie theaters. Yeah, no. Um, although he's not as bad as Bowser. When Bowser wave dashes, the entire screen shakes. <laughs> it was sucks. It's, it's, it's pretty awful. awful. <laughs> Thankfully, he, he doesn't get a lot off of the move. So if you ever fight a Bowser, the screen won't shake too much. Also, you probably won't ever fight a Bowser in tournament. Have fun with that if you do. Yeah. Because don't get up beat. Don't get up beat. Yeah. And don't get side beat. Spoiler alert is that no matter what I say, you'll get up beat. Oh, Ooh. a phantom on that. Phantom that would have uh, sealed it. Instead, he just takes him across the coast, finishes it up over there. Rick's looking really comfortable in this match. Oh. But the call out up air, and he didn't hold field. back, right? Yeah. Isn't that how that it works? You hold back, or you just let go of the direction you're going. Yeah, and he just forgot to do that, I guess. Now you hear it. You hear uh -oh. it at home. Yeah, no. Nah. 66% <laughs> off three moves. It, they can hear it over in Sweden. <laughs> <laughs> Ganon and Luigi. Those are the guys that make the most And voice. now it's and actually TM, even. <laughs> TM just brought it all the way back. Rick's <laughs> pulling out the gun. I'm not sure if that's a... That's the right thing to do in this state of the game. I love the echo on Ganon's ha on his forward <laughs> smash. It's so like, yeah, I'm going to do this. <laughs> Take it's that. Like, yeah, dude, get hype. All my moves have bass, including my voice. <laughs> All right. Oh, I like that shine from him, and TM just kind of forgets to press B and up. All he right. might have thought he had a jump. That's true. That's true. He, and he's like... I mean, I, at I that point, you're kind of like mashing the gray buttons, thinking, oh, I'm going to get up. I think I'm it got eight when uh, the Shine or Nair hit. Is that a Ravenclaw shirt? Yeah, <laughs> I, I pointed that out. He's oh. got that Ravenclaw shirt, dude. Oh. Shout out to the bird. But he's not even playing the bird. We miss the bird. Yeah, dude. I miss Rick's bird. Rick doesn't miss the bird. The Falco King with the cool color of olive green. He was, yeah. Blech. <laughs> 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 Is it worse green than the, the green of Yoshi's? Except that's a godlike Wait, green. are both of them playing green Ganon? Yeah. <laughs> no, they, no, they are not both playing green Ganon. Oh, sorry, sorry, green green characters. Dude, I don't know why anyone plays green Ganon. <laughs> <laughs> it's disgusting. Blue Ganon is godlike. Blue, the blueberry Ganon. I, yeah. I kind of like red Ganon, but purple Ganon is top tier. But back that's, to the, that's the mystic. Back to yeah, the Yeah, back match. to the match. Back to the match. Oh, that's... Okay, Randall's Ooh. helping him out, but Rick's taking that trade he's every like, day yeah. of the week. He's like, yeah, every Ganon, hour. You, Ganon's usually the trade master, but I'll, you know? I'll take that. Well, I, I was talking earlier, I forget uh, who it was with, but I was talking about how Ganon is the trade master, but for different reasons that characters like Peach and Samus are. You know, Peach and Samus can live for a very long time, and Ganon might not live for a long time, but every time you get hit, <laughs> you know that you lost. Yeah, like, that, that's why he's the trade master, because instead of taking... 11% like he may take, wow, what? you're going to take four, like 40. Yeah, pretty much. High exaggeration there, maybe 22. So this was a really smart counterfeit from TM. Ganon Land has always been a favorite. Ganon's story, and then you got Ganon Land if you want to live for a while. No, no, no. 
I, I, I will always call this game in land. I don't know why. It's because Marth's story is already thing. Yeah, good point. Because, I don't know. Ganon, Dreamland does make him live long, but against a good edge guarder, it's generally not what you want to do. His downward uh, forward tilts have been it's so good. very good. That, oh, wow. that, that's not a good option. Wow. Mm -mm. He uh, dares him. Oh, oh no. But <laughs> TM dares him right back. <laughs> Oh, nice. Wow, just goes down there. That's one of those where you can punish the end lag on the down B. So I'm actually kind of surprised that both of these players have made it this far in the bracket for different reasons. TM is always going to be held back by his character. Yeah, and it, I mean, it's like, Ganon. It's Ganon. And Ganon does, I, I would consider him quasi viable. But at the end of the day, like, if you know people can fight against Ganon, it gets so hard. Yeah. And then Rick, of course, he's young, and he's usually succumbs to nerves before this point. He's, had, right he's now, got some wins. He's, um, got, he's got good wins. And he's got this win. Yeah, another one. <laughs> that was winners, wasn't it?